Hello, I am SS Kelp, and this is my first solo Let's Play of Minecraft that I am ever recording. So, bear with me here. I don't have a fancy setup. I have less than bare minimum, I'd say, but that's not going to stop me. I will do what I want. And with that being said, let's go ahead and start gathering up some wood here. I have my crafting table now. Let's go ahead and make some sticks so that I can go ahead and start on some basic tools. And then eventually maybe upgrade. I also probably want to make a sword just so I can kill these sheep. So that we can get a bed so that I'm not, you know, just building a dirt house. <laughs> For the first night. Um, if you've played Minecraft before, we all know how that goes. So, first things first. Sword and wool. And wood, of course, because you need wood to make the... Y you get it. You get it. But yeah. Thankfully, all three of these sheep are the same color. I just love when they're <laughs> all different colors. Because then it makes it so much more fun. All sarcasm intended. Yeah, so let's go ahead and make that bed. I Did I not get wool from that guy? Or did I just not pick it up? Oh. Wow. Maybe I should check my inventory before I go start crafting stuff, eh? Alright, so we have our plain white bed. And maybe now time to get some cobblestone. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and dig down. And I will come back to you guys once I have my stone tools. Alright guys, so I have my 25 cobblestone. Because, you know, it's better than 24. If you know, you know. And I'm going to go ahead and start crafting those tools if I can. But it looks like I may run out of sticks. Let's go ahead and do a sword first. I feel like that's very important. And then we can go ahead and do a stone pickaxe. That's pretty important. And then I'd say an axe so that I can get some more wood. I think that that's vital to our survival. I'm just going to throw those out and I'm going to collect this bad boy up. There we are. Now, I don't know exactly where I want to build my home. I think, I think maybe I should travel a bit and see where the road takes me, you know? Maybe collect up some food along the way. I do see some pumpkins back there. I don't know if you guys can see them. But yeah, they're, they're behind me. So I'm going to go ahead and collect a pumpkin or two. That way when I do have my house, I can get started on a pumpkin farm. Then we can make some pumpkin pie. Maybe make some helmets, you know, for... I, I believe it, you can still use them to fight Endermen. I think so. Or, you know, to avoid fighting Ender Endermen in the end when you're fighting the Ender Dragon. I think the goal of this series for me is to maybe fight the Ender Dragon by myself. I've never done it by myself. So that is something that I really would like to accomplish. Um, so yeah, hopefully I can do that in this series and not freak out too much. I have a tendency to freak out when things come at me. Um... Hence why I'm playing Minecraft and not like a first-person shooter, because that's just not my forte. I would much rather prefer a sandbox, <laughs> sandbox style game over, you know, like goal-oriented games, I'd say. Because this way you can make your own goals. Like, I do appreciate goals, but I just like to make my own. I don't like to be told what to do. <laughs> um, so maybe just collect up a few more oak. Um, and see where the road takes me. Uh, hello, sheepy sheepy. Don't mind if I do. Thank you very much. And you too, sheepy sheepy. Alright guys, so it is starting to get dark. Um, I did hear a zombie in the tree somewhere, so hopefully he can't get to me. Um, we're just gonna... Oh, cool. There's a creeper. We love that. Hello, sir. <laughs> um, so I'm... Oh, God. I really don't like that sound. We're just going to go ahead and have our first sleep of the night. 
I guess not. We gotta wait till it's nighttime. Although, it sure looks like it's night to me. Nope. Oh, there's monsters nearby. How perfect. Ah. Uh, well, I really didn't want to spend my first night like this, but maybe I have to. Oh, no. Oh. Okay. Honestly, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. But I am going to just go ahead and block the- Oh no, the Enderman. I hope I didn't look at him. Oh no. Oh no. Oh yay! Maybe now they'll be gone? Oh no, Enderman. Oh god, oh god. I don't want him to look up here. Oh no. <gasps> See what I mean? I'm just so jumpy. But I want some of this cobblestone back. Because, you know, we're just starting off. And that's going to be very important. Oh, that zombie is on fire. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, he's right there. Oh no. I guess we're gonna just, just run for it. Yes. Nice, nice. We do need that leather. So guys, I think I have finally found where I want to build my home. I think I want to build it over there. Like I want to start building on that little part there, maybe eventually up there and there's like a nice little round pool here. And also, I did find a an abandoned nether portal. Yeah, so there's the abandoned nether portal and there's a village. So I can work on some trading and, you know, get more into that because I've never really done much trading. I felt like it wasn't, wasn't really worth it, but... Maybe if I could convert a zombie villager, maybe I can get some better trades that way. But I'm going to go ahead. Ooh, fire protection, blast protection. You know, I don't have any armor, so that's going to be good for now. And the golden apple. Ooh, nice. I got some iron already. I haven't found any iron or coal yet. Actually, that's not true. I found some coal, but I didn't want to mine it because of how close it was to caves and stuff like that. A silk touch golden pickaxe. That's going to be good. Maybe if I could, you know. I'll have to repair it every so often. And a mending golden shovel. Interesting. Okay, well, I'm just going to go ahead and throw this on right quick. That way I have a little bit of protection. All right, yeah, look at that. Four armor. Uh, all right, and it looks like it's getting dark. So I'm probably just going to go over here to the village and have a sleep in one of their beds. Hope they don't mind. <laughs> it's fine. We can share. But there is no bed in here, so I'm just going to go ahead and plop mine down right there. And as soon as it gets dark, we're just going to go ahead and have a sleep. And I'm not sure exactly what I want to build my house out of. Um, There are some birch and some oak. I did pass by a jungle on my way. I really like the way jungle wood doors look like. Or <laughs> I like the way jungle wood doors look. Um, So I think I'll use those for the doors. Maybe some... I don't know. We have oak and birch and the jungle wood. I didn't see any spruce or dark oak though. So I don't know. Maybe we'll have to go on an adventure for that if I want any of that. I'm not sure exactly yet, but yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and loot this village. I will come back when I have all the goodies. All right, guys. So I have looted the village and I took one of their blast furnaces and the stone cutter because I can, frankly. That's the only reason. Um, well, not the only reason. It has uses. And, uh, I just need to start building my house. So let's go back over to where I wanted to build. And then we'll get go from there. So I am in the area where I want to build my house. I don't know exactly what I'm going to build with yet. But once we get this area of trees cleared out then I can definitely work on that. So for now, I'm just gonna go ahead and figure out how to toggle my screen, <laughs> my perspective, and I'm just gonna go ahead and place my bed down on top of these. And I'm gonna have me asleep.
All right, so it is the morning and I have a lot of work cut out for me. So I'm just gonna go ahead and cut down all these trees and skip ahead and I'll show you when it's all done. All right guys, so I have terraformed this area up a little bit. It could be a little bit neater and nicer, but I'm, you know, I'm still new to this addition and I've never really terraformed that much before. So with that being said, I think I did a pretty decent job, um, but I definitely need to collect a lot of more materials and stuff like that. So I don't know if I can do that in between episodes. The next episode will probably just me be uh, building my house unless you guys want me to film going into the cave and getting some materials and strip mining and all that. Um, some strip mining is a bit boring, but maybe I could. Oh, <laughs> maybe I could maybe make a mine here, like put an entryway there, like a big arch. Or maybe like diagonally into that cave there. Um, I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below whether you would like me to just build my house and do the boring stuff in between. Or if you would like me to mine in my next episode and collect the materials for the house. Alright, thank you for watching. Bye!